Hey guys, me, CM Prime, and um, this video is about my school project, English school project, bloopers, where um, the whole project was so talk about English persuasive words like pathos, ethos, and ethos. We chose Trump moving troops out of Afghanistan, so don't take any of it seriously, it's just a joke, and all this is, but all these are bloopers, so it doesn't really matter. And for the most part, I'm cameraman in this until you start seeing my face in the Black Panther jacket. And I hope you guys enjoy this. And if you want to see the full video, like the finished product of us editing and stuff, where we actually got it right, um, comment down below and I'll post it. Well, till next time, peace. What if my phone just falls in the video? <laughs> and then, and no, it falls and then you just cut. <laughs> Wait, are you recording? <laughs> Edgar. Why are you holding your camera? Edgar. What? Any thoughts? No. None at all? Christian? Huh? Any thoughts? Trump's poll light game is weak. You can go, alright. Mm -hmm. Okay. Welcome to Prime News. My name is Christian Valdez, Jonathan Valdez, Villasenor, Alejandro ja Jimenez, fucking whatever the fuck. Oh, <laughs> alright. Damn. Damn, I'm your ass fuck. What the? Welcome to Prime News. I'm your fucking host. Stop. Get the fuck out of our seat! Distracting them. Hey, take one picture for me. Cause I'll put it on my Instagram. So I got 50% baby. You see? You gotta make up like a fucked up long ass Mexican last name. Or like Mexican. My name is my name is George Chavez Pizzo Escobar. Longer than that. Nigga, that's a long ass. Good luck. Keep with the long ass one. Stop recording, baby. <laughs> Bro, if you want my ass that bad, just ask. You gonna start? <laughs> Wait, oh, oh, oh shit. Oh. oh my! Welcome to Prime News. I'm your host, Christian Valdez, Jr. Valdez via Senor, Huevos Peludos, and I'm one, and I'm joined <laughs> by my host here, Edgar. Oh shoot. Today's hot topic is about stopping Trump from pulling out the troops in Afghanistan. President Trump has ordered a withdrawal from 2,000 American troops. We didn't fuck up yet? From Syria. Why the Hello, welcome to Prime News. I am your host, Christian Jonathan Valdez Vision and Ramirez Alberto Fernandez, Nalgon Huevos Peludos, and I'm here joined by my co host, Edgar. Today's hot topic is about stopping Trump from pulling out the troops in Afghanistan. Trump ordered with the withdrawal of 2,000 Afghanistan troops. I mean, damn it! <laughs> hey, welcome to Prime News. I am your host, Christian Johnson, and this is Senor Junior Ramirez, Jimenez, Alberto, fucking Webos. Oh my God! <laughs> Prime News. I am your host, Christian Jonathan Valdez, via Senor Alberto Jimenez, Webos Peludos, Nalgon, and I'm here joined by my host, <laughs> Edgar. You laughed, bro. Oh Come on. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Prime News. I am your boy, Christian Jonathan Valdez, via Senor Jimenez, Alberto Jimenez. I said Jimenez twice. Doesn't matter. Webos Peludos, Nalgon. I'm here joined by my co-host. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I supposed to put this? I gotta get my butt ready. Are you one beefy boy? Thanks, I hear. Uh, I'm here with one of the terrorists. One <laughs> Where's Edgar though? Thanks, Edgar. Today I'm here with an uh, Afghanistan uh, civilian. Hi, I'm with you. How do you feel about Trump moving his troops out of your country? I think it's a great idea. Because I can do whatever I want, you know, bomb whoever I want. How do you feel about the, tal the Taliban getting more power? Oh yeah, we need more power, guys. We need, we need to take over the world. You're part of them? Technically, right? Wait, oh, wait, wasn't I part of the Taliban? <laughs> wait, wasn't I part of them? Yes, you are! Yeah, exactly, I'm part of them. <laughs> I was like, are you part of it? <laughs> I was so confused. <laughs> Thanks, Edgar. I'm here with a Afghanistan civilian. Hi, I'm the Bill Khan. How do you feel about Trump moving his troops out of your country? I think it's a really good idea. Because we'll get a lot more power and we'll bring it to wherever we want. What do you think you would do with all this power? Uh, we would take over the world, we would start wars, we would do inappropriate things to people. That's what we do. 
So, what was the main obstacle about the uh, American forces in the country? Uh, they're, they're basically blocking us from certain parts of our country, so we can't access that. And everything bad that we do, they're always there to stop. Taliban are now stronger than 9-11, when they committed 9-11. So, we pulled the troops out, we would be giving them even more power to do terrorist attacks all over the world which would affect us tremendously. So Matt, just on 9-11 alone, 2, 000, over 2,000 people have died, and over 6,000 were injured. The kill count of the Taliban are over 100,000. Imagine how much those numbers will go if they continue to get more power. <laughs> oh, look at over there looking at us. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Edgar. Today I'm here with an Afghanistan civilian right now. He's a terror. Why do you do Behind the scenes. <laughs> Behind the scenes. <laughs> Behind the scenes, making this man into a terrorist. <laughs> Beautiful. How do you feel about your artwork? Uh, I feel amazing. Thank you, Chris. Trump's division can much lead to the many attacks on the U.S. So remember, don't be a group, keep in the truth. And stop Trump from pulling out the American soul from Afghanistan. Because the time is signing off. For the glory of Afghanistan! That's becoming contagious. I'm the type of dude that will always be ageless. I'm the type of dude that will always feel shameless. I'm